All right, so hey, what's going on you guys? This is Keno over at Ask a Jeeper, and today we're gonna be fixing that rough idle problem that we have. So we finally got the clutch position sensor and then the ignition coil for the V6 4.0 liter. I'm gonna be teaching you how to install it. First, we're just gonna take off the air intake so we have better access to um, the throttle body. Um, so we can just pull that sensor out real quick and then I'll show you how to take out um, the ignition coil. It's super easy. Just pull it out, put the new one in, plug everything back in and you're good to go, so. Okay, so first things first, you'll have four latches on either side, and then you'll need to take a flathead screwdriver um, and just loosen this up so you'll be able to pull this top part off. Make sure you do all four clips. Just pull this top part of the intake and set it somewhere. I'm just gonna set that right there. And then what you'll need to do is pull, pull this part of the intake off. You've got another um, flathead screwdriver or flathead um, clamp that you'll have to use um, right down there and then we have a bolt right here that we'll need to undo so and I don't think I think there might be a tube connection back here but I'm not I'm not completely sure I don't think so so we're just gonna take this off real quick and we'll do that all right, so here's the bolt for that, and then all you need to do is just kind of shimmy it off. You'll have um, a little rubber piece under here um, that you'll have to, to, to take off. Um, it's just pinned to it, um, and so you'll just have to kind of force that out and then just, just take this off, and then boom, set that down. And then I believe on the V8, um, the throttle body position sensor will be right here, but on ours, it's, uh, it's right here. So all, so all you need to do just push this pin down right here um, then just kind of push it back and then just slide it off. Sorry, I didn't really get that, but you'll just slide it off like that. And then right here, um, you'll have two torque screws um, that you'll have to get uh, and you've got two bolts on either side. You'll just need to take those out. I hate the position that this is in because you can't really see it, um, but I'm going to go ahead and get those loose. Well, we're driving it right now. Seems like we got it figured out. Um, it's still have, fa having that idling problem. The check engine light is turned off. So much for watching. Um, stay tuned for that video. It's gonna be coming when I get the parts in and uh, we'll see you later. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button as well.